In fashion, the introductions and then the ceremonial puck drop with Adam Graves and with two Ranger legends, Harry Howell, Andy Bathgate, and together on February 22nd, 2009, these gentlemen will have their numbers retired right here at the Garden Rafters. Harry, how exciting is that going to be for you? It's going to be very exciting since I haven't played here for about 40 years and uh, didn't think it would ever happen. But uh, I'm very pleased and uh, you know honored that it's going to happen. Andy, number nine is going to go up and it's going to have your name on it. What's that going to be like for you? Well, I'm the last one of the six fellas who I competed against pretty well my whole career to, to get up there. And I'm very happy it's happened and uh, very not honored to say the least. When you're in the building on a night like tonight where you can sense and feel the emotion and the passion of the crowd, does it bring you back to your playing days in New York? Yeah, well, I think they're a lot more passionate now. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, that, that's the greatest crowd you could ever have. Boy. What do you think of when you think about your time in New York? Andy? Well, it, we had to go every night and we didn't really know what the ice was going to be like. It was, was a problem at that time because there were so many activities in the, the garden at that time. So. You went out and tested it, but once we got going, we got used to it, and uh, you had to move the puck very quickly, especially early in the period. That hasn't and changed very much. It seems like that's what we saw tonight, a lot of quick yeah. puck movement from these guys. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. and your feeling when you watch this Ranger team now and, and, and just the thought that only a couple months from now you're going to look up at the Garden Rafters and see that, that banner go up. <laughs> I mean, you've seen other banner-raising yeah, ceremonies yeah. where tears have flowed. Do you yeah. expect that kind of emotion? Uh, I don't know. I, I'm going to have a lot of family down here, so I don't know what to expect, really. But uh, I'm looking forward to it, and it will be a great honor. Andy. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to it, be uh, sort of ending a decent career, and I uh, really appreciate it because uh, it, I think my grandchildren will really enjoy it very much. When you talk to your grandchildren, both of you, about yeah. your career, what are the things that they want to know? What are the things you tell them? Well, they're just getting old enough to really understand what we, what we were doing when we were working for a living. And uh, <laughs> but my, one of my grandsons has quite a bit of potential, I think, anyway. And you may be hearing from them somewhere along the line, but uh, it, it's just nice to be remembered. After all these years, I never thought that it would ever go up, so that would it's be a cool. blessing in disguise. Yeah. So. And how about you, when, when people ask you, your family asks you about your career? Well, my uh, grandson is a great follower. He's, he's in his 20s now, and uh, he's a great hockey fan, and he always wonders, when are you getting another uh, sweater or jacket, Grandpa? <laughs> it's like, the need, I need a new one. but. Uh, they're great kids. All my grandchildren are super kids. One's a girl, one's a boy, but uh, they're both hockey fans. Number three, Harry Howell. Number nine, Andy Bathgate. The numbers will go up February 22nd right here at the Garden. It'll be a monumental and emotional night, and it'll be the Rangers and Toronto Maple Leafs. Great to have you guys. Thanks, Thanks for We'll be back in a moment right here on MSG.